wastes. Uh, you have a lot of the information about waste, their types, definition, characteristics uh, in lecture and the book. I'm giving just a general scheme for the waste, their assessment and management. So first of all, classification of the waste. Main classification is classification according to the physical state. We have solid and liquid because the type of disposal, how we will transport and collect this waste will depend on the physical state. It's very simple. Next classification we divide by general and specific. This classification we have just to mark which one specific. For example, hospitals waste, radioactive waste, because for the, this waste has higher danger comparing with the general types of the waste. That's why we have special ways of their collection, their storage, and special ways of their treatment. These types of device you will study on the certain topics, like for hospital topic, for a directive topic, and in this topic you will talk about the management of these types of device. And also, like most modern classification of device, it's recyclable and non-recyclable. Those which we could convert to get something, and those which unfortunately not. And you should know that even recyclable waste have the limit of recycling. So we recy will recycle them up to some limit. All the system of waste management called sanitary purification of settlement. This system should, these measures should be systematic, regular, utility, and independent. And sanitary purification of the settlements consists of the three stages. Stage one, collection and temporary keeping. Basically, we have two types, neighborhood based and door to door. Neighborhood based mostly for multi storied buildings in city. We have one area with special uh, buckets for the uh, waste. It could be marked for the separate collection, it could be made underground, for example, or made in the uh, special places in houses. But from few houses, we have collection in one place. Or door to drawer, mostly for private houses, each private house with own place for waste, own buckets for waste, etc. Second stage, removing and disposing. So we need to transport our waste and temporarily keep somewhere before treatment. Removing type mostly based on the physical state, flushing, pickup and mixed. Except physical state, type of removing depends on presence of the canalization in the uh, settlement. If the settlement canalized, we will use mostly mixed. Mixed includes and flushing and pickup. Flushing for liquid and small solid and pickup for big solid waste. If the settlement non canalized, we will use only pickup for solid and for liquid waste both. And the last stage is treatment. We have methods of utilization and liquidation. Of course, utilization is better because utilization given us possibility to not pollute the environment or less pollute the environment because we're recycling for uh, new materials. Biothermic, it's also recycled, but for organic waste, when organic waste convert into energy and some chemical compounds which could be used in further in chemical industry, for example. Composting, it's also for organic substances, making the fertilizers, natural fertilizers. Also thermal and chemical when we burn uh, the waste to get energy, for example, in hot water. Liquidation, like dumping in sea, in water, storage, making the landfills, it's unfortunately not a very good method, it's pollution of the environment, but sometimes we have to use this method, we don't have other choice.